Kevin Bigsby lives near the Oregon Mountains, and he's been hiking the trails here for the past 22 years. I see that the desert is greening up quite a bit after the rains we've had. Bigsby is the executive director of the Southwest Environmental Center in Las Cruces and wants to see the Oregon Mountains protected as wilderness. For me, the most important reason for protecting an area as wilderness is if you look at what's happening worldwide on this planet, we're losing species of plants and animals at a very rapid rate due to human activities. And wilderness protection is the strongest protection we can give to natural areas. Bixby says only 2% of New Mexico's lands are protected as wilderness, which is less than the national average. The campaign for wilderness designation in Doña Ana County was started by the New Mexico Wilderness Alliance about five years ago. And now the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce, Green Chamber of Commerce, and many other local groups support the Oregon Mountain Desert Peaks Wilderness Act. Introduced by Senators Tom Udall and Jeff Bingaman, the bill would create 241,000 acres of wilderness and is up for consideration by the Senate. However, the Greater Las Cruces Chamber of Commerce is against the bill. It's been driven by wilderness advocates. They have wilderness on their business cards. How did we let that happen? Says Tom Hutchinson, chairman of the Chamber Issues Committee. Other chamber board members like John Hummer oppose the wilderness bill because of U.S.-Mexico border safety concerns. If Switzerland was our neighbor, this would be a whole different discussion. We don't have that luxury. Mexico is our, is our neighbor and we have a real problem. It's real, it's a threat, and we can avoid it. Hummer says he doesn't oppose wilderness in the Oregon Mountains, but doesn't want the Patrios Mountains near the border to become wilderness because he says it would restrict Border Patrol officers from driving in certain areas. You can look right in Arizona and you can see um, what is happening. And the largest influx of illegal drug trafficking, human trafficking, is taking place in protected wilderness area. Back on the Oregon Mountain hiking trail, Kevin Bigsby says the wilderness bill has been altered enough to give Border Patrol officers the ability to police the area. The bill that would create wilderness in Doniana County was amended to address those concerns. So the current legislation is supported by the Border Patrol. Bigsby says he hopes the bill passes so the trails he loves to hike on will be permanently protected. For KRWG, I'm Jared Anderson.